Hey everyone and welcome to another video. Today what we're doing is taking a look at another question that was sent in to me about the Zidu Z9X. So this is from Scrapyard Wars and they've commented how to stop the damn thing playing subtitles before the film starts as a default. And then the second part of it is if you power it off, one loses the post wall and requires restore of the backup, not ideal for automation. So there are two parts to the actual question or the comment. So we'll deal with the first one first. So in post wall, by default yeah subtitles will come on and it can be quite annoying it's not in post wall that you actually disable the subtitles so what you need to do is come back to your main settings and you come down to default language and then you come across and in this setting you need to make sure that default subtitles is set to shut down so originally this will probably be on automatic or something else now as soon as you set this to shut down it means that it will no longer load regardless of what app you're actually using so that's the thing this is a global setting that you need to actually change so that will solve your issues with regards to subtitles now with regards to the post wall disappearing or not working that's that's not something that I've experienced. So for me, every single time I actually use my Zidu, I do actually turn it off at night because of the automations that I have set up. One thing I would suggest is if you're having a problem where your Zidu, your post wall, sorry, stops working, then you need to come in and check what firmware you're using. So if I remember correctly, if we come down to update and then come to system upgrade, here is the software version that I'm using. Now this I believe is a beta version and the reason I'm using a beta version is because otherwise the movies trailers don't work. For me, it still doesn't work for TV shows, which it probably should do, but the movies do work. So that's why I've reverted to this beta version. I believe there is a newer version possibly out there, but I don't wanna risk that breaking the movie trailers for me. So this is the version that I'm using. If you are having issues with your setup, then what I suggest you do is a clean install and then just make sure you're either on the latest firmware, so latest firmware for the actual Zidu player, and then you can go about reinstalling Postwall or Home Theater 4, I believe, as it's known. So yeah, just there. So that's the actual app that is loading in the background. Obviously the Postwall, that's just how they sort of badge it up in this, this version of software that I've actually, or the skin that I've got running, but this is essentially the same thing. So this is Home Theater 4. That is what is ultimately running. So what I suggest that you do is do those two steps, check your firmware if need be, do a factory reset, and then upgrade your firmware. If you wanna to go to the latest, you can do, but you don't necessarily have to. As I mentioned, this beta version runs perfectly fine for me. With regards to reinstalling Home Theater 4, I believe that's more complicated, but you can do it. I just wouldn't recommend removing and reinstalling it if you don't need to, because it's not the easiest of process, and depending on which firmware version you're on, it can differ as well. So hopefully that's been helpful. If you do have any further questions, drop them in the comment section below and I'll do my best once again to make another video and help you guys out. If you haven't already done so, please do subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss out on any future videos. And I'd really appreciate if you can give this video a thumbs up. And until the next one, thanks very much for watching.